So we can get more information as um, they arrive to fully brief them when they arrive. Okay, I'm sorry, I can barely understand what you're saying. So what's the medical emergency? Uh, for heavy bleeding. So um, heavy bleeding. There's a, uh, yeah, there's a doctor by the patient's side, and uh -huh. they will be able to fully brief them once the paramedics arrive. Uh, oh, okay. Tell me exactly what happened. Uh, we have a patient who was here for a surgical procedure and not sure if her uterus was perforated or not, but she will not stop bleeding. Okay. Is this pre or, and I just want to clarify with you, is this pre or post procedure? Post. Okay. And I, I just want to clarify with you, this is, is this vaginal bleeding or? Uterine. Uterine, okay. I apologize if this is an odd question. Has the afterbirth been delivered yet? Um, I'm not sure the answer to that. Okay. Is the blood spraying or pouring out? Pouring. Tell me exactly what happened. Um, we have a patient here for um, an in-clinic um, uh, abortion um, procedure, and we had, she gave, got fentanyl and midazolam, and now she's unresponsive. We've given her two doses of Narcan and midazolam, um, and she's still non-responsive. Vitals are stable. Let me get help started. Just one moment. How old is she? How old is, how old is she? Uh, she is 21. 21 years old. The patient just underwent an abortion and she had an injury to the uterus. She's having some bleeding. It's controlled right now, but she does need to get to the hospital. And if it's possible for them to come with no lights or sirens, we would appreciate that. Oh, that's for their safety, unfortunately. Um, Doc tried to perform a DNA on a patient, and he believes her uterus is perforated. Emergent or non-emergent? Um, as of right now, non-emergent. But if she starts bleeding into her abdomen, it could become an emergency pretty fast. <laughs>
Um, I'm a nurse here. We do surgical procedures, and we just had a patient um, that has a surgical procedure, and she something's going on. Her sugar is really low. She can't even get up, and they want to go to the hospital. And the doctor suggested that she go to the hospital, and they she doesn't feel comfortable going, so she wants they want us to call 911 so they can get an ambulance.